Hey guys, what's up? This is Ziploc Rules 2013, and welcome back to Let's Play Super Monkey Ball Jr. Uh, today we're going to be finishing up the uh, mini game section here, and um, we're going to be playing some monkey golf. So, um, this is, by the way, just a basic game of mini golf with uh, similar controls to uh, bowling, to monkey bowling, except it's a little bit little bit easier you have a little more control in this one so it's definitely a plus but it's basic mini golf two nine hole courses are available uh, you have the normal grassland course and of course you've got the extra arctic course which we will i don't expect i'll have to split these up or anything i'll probably get through both of them today just in this one episode so one player can play this again four players on a single system if you so wish quickly take a swig of that hole one these are all part three uh, on the beginner course they are all going to be part three courses and so that is very nice and uh, you can of course adjust your distance here so there's 20 yard distance I'm gonna go with the 20 you can go up to 40 with a single shot I'm just gonna stick with 20 here and so we're gonna go ahead and kick the ball over and um, simple as that you're aiming to get a hole in one if at all possible so <laughs> definitely very useful to uh, maintain your power maintain your power that almost uh, that almost skipped out of the hole there that wouldn't have been good uh, I have not actually by the way seen the Arctic course so I don't really know what to expect and they score you they score you really weirdly here they give you points instead of letting you go above par under par and all that sort of stuff it's really odd the way that they score you in this game but um, yeah we're just gonna kind of go through here normally and uh, it's a pretty straight path to the end but it's really weird like you'll get one or two points usually for each uh, each course obviously since you only have par threes here the maximum number of points you can get is three if you get a hole in one and uh, I don't know it's just really weird the way that the scoring works you know normally you'd have above par under par that kind of stuff ah shit <laughs> oh god out of bounds uh, let's go with the 20-yarder. I was thinking that going 40 would help out there, but I guess not. Okay, and that's not enough. Okay. Oh, God. Okay. So you obviously get a limited number of shots, so we can't squander too much of this. But, oh, my God. Okay, see, I don't like this course at all. <laughs> um, I don't want to have to reset this one either or have to skip it. But, yeah, there's... Oh my god, what? Are you shitting me? Dude, I literally played this just the other night. I didn't have any problems with this. This course, I got in like two shots. What the hell's that? That's bullcrap. Get in there. Okay, thank god. Cup at nine? What the fuck? What the hell's that? That's bullcrap. Nine. Oh. Oh, actually, I got the scoring. No, it actually gives you the number of... Okay, the number of points you get is based on how many shots you take. Okay. Yeah, I never really took uh, notice of the points. I thought it was just based on whether you got a birdie or not. Or whether it was par and it would only give you, like, one point. Apparently, I'm wrong. That is not how this works, apparently. Come on, give us a hole in one. Give us a hole in one. Oh, no. Dang it close oh that sucks get in there I did not really just miss that I really just missed that wow that's that's embarrassing wow I just got a par <laughs> I just got a freaking par on that oh my gosh okay yeah I didn't really take note of that apparently it's the number of shots you take is the number of points you get. I didn't realize that. I didn't really take notice of that when I was playing last night. I don't know. It's a little weird. Okay, this one gives us the 20-yarder. 
this one, you want to try and get up this hill. And, ooh, nice. Okay, I had a little trouble here when I was playing on my own. Looks like we're pretty solid now. Get in there. Yeah, we got a birdie. So it scores. Score wise. Okay, the number of points you get is obviously a little weird, but based on like actual scoring, like par, birdie, bogey, all that stuff, that works just the same way as it does in normal golf. So, you know, even if you played something as basic as like Wii Sports Golf, you basically know what to expect. Like, obviously, you get the ball in three shots on a par three, that's par. Four or five shots on a par five, then that's uh, also a par. If you get it in one shot under par, then that's a birdie. Two under would be an eagle, three under is albatross, and then, uh, yeah, pretty much just goes from that. You can get a hole in one. I don't know if there's any par fives on, uh, on uh, the Arctic course. I have not played the Arctic course, so I can't really, can't really say. So can't say I really know how, oh wow. Can't really say I know how this is laid out either. This is, hang on. Okay, I forgot you can actually, if you press R, you can press a little preview here. I almost wonder if I could shoot the ball over straight to the cup. Like I'm kind of aimed for that now. Let's see. I'm not really worried about, oh wow, wow that was close. I'm not really worried about my shot, about my score. I'm going to do terrible regardless, but... Oh, dude, that would have been so insane. Ah, oh, dang it. Okay, but yeah, I'm not really too concerned about my score, to be honest with you. I'm just kind of here to screw around. Uh, well, we'll not screw around. I want to show it off, basically. I'm just here to basically show the mode off, so if I don't... If I don't get it, if I don't get a good score, then... Oh, wow. Not really gonna... Not really gonna fuss over it. Is that a give up? I know you give up if you take two. Oh, yep. Yeah, that's a give up. Dang it. <laughs> okay, 30. The best score that was on the leaderboard was like 50 shots. So I think I should still be good to at least, uh, you know, beat that. But yeah, 30. I'm definitely not where I was hoping I'd be. That is not where I wanted to be on the second shot either. That is... Yeah, that's also not where I was looking to be. <laughs> Dang it. Uh, let's go with this. Come on. You gotta get up there. Get up there. What? Oh, I thought that was the 40. Oh, crap, I didn't look. I just went one up assuming it would give me the... No, now it's at 20. Uh, oh, what the hell? <laughs> I'm angled so awkwardly. I can't do that. Dude, I literally can't do that. It angles me so inconveniently. That is so not good. Like, look at that. Going up there. Oh, God. Okay, I don't like this hole. <laughs> I don't think I got to this hole last time when I was playing off, off camera. I don't think I... That still wasn't good enough? Dude, what the crap? <laughs> oh, I don't like this hole at all. No. Oh, God, excuse me. No, 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 I hate this hole. No, screw this. Get up there. Thank you. What the hell? That shouldn't have taken that many shots. I'm still gonna be under... Okay, still gonna be under the top score. Or, or beating the top score, anyway. So, okay, it's 28 yards. Let's go for it. Let's go. Come on. No! Ah, oh, I got caught on the little, uh, the slope there. Dang it, the slope totally caught it. That was, ah. Uh, that was so close. That was, that was so gonna make it. Ah, oh, Darn. Okay, well, I got the last one in two. All right, 39. I think the best score on here was like 46 or something. Yeah, so that's first place. 
the previous owner only had one score on the leaderboard, I'm pretty sure, so beating his record shouldn't exactly be too difficult, but let's see, what do we get? Oh wow, I beat him by 10 whole shots, look at that, whoever dad is. Huh. I was seeing other names, I almost wonder if the dad was like the owner of this cartridge and maybe his son was playing on it or something, I have no idea. I don't know. This seems like a game you'd give to a child. I mean, Game Boy Advance is pretty cheap, so I could definitely see a father buying this for their child. You know, it's not like a Switch where everything's 60 bucks, but yeah. So I guess the dad was playing some golf. <laughs> he didn't want to go out on the golf course, so he just wanted to take his kid's Game Boy and just play monkey golf. Uh, it's funny to think about, but we're going to go ahead and go to course B. Wow, this is going to be over quick. Only 11 minutes in. This is going to be over quick. Let's go. I'm going to go Mimi. I like Mimi. Very, uh, I always like, I think Mimi was one of the characters I really like to use in Monkey Ball 1, so. I don't know. Nostalgia bias. <laughs> oh, nostalgia bias. You are something else. Let's see. See how well that banks off. Get in there. Get in there. Get in there. No. Ah, oh, dude. I want to get a hole in one here so bad. I know I can. Are you? Fu okay, now I'm resetting this. I'm reset. Oh God, no! I'm resetting that. All right. Look at that. Hole in. Oh, they don't even spell out one. It's just the number one. Hole in one. All right. It's so weird. I, I'm sorry. I had to get a home one there. Like, that was going to be the hole to get a home one on. Like, it was. If there was going to be one, that was it. So, I, I just felt the need to get that one right there. Let's see. Uh, it's just going to. Uh, I'm going to have to go for this one. Let's just go for it. Oh! Oh! Damn. Okay, a little, a little too powerful there. But yeah, um. Oh man, this is really fun. This is really a lot of... Okay, okay. I actually have to lower the power. Yes. Oh man. Let's go there. No, not... God dang it. Okay. Ugh. Yeah. This is why I'm not a big fan of mini golf. I'm just... Uh, I just... I prefer actual golf simulators. Dude, you fucking gotta be kidding me. Okay, well, screw my hole-in-one, actually meaning anything. Yep, screw my hole-in-one, actually meaning anything. That's an extra 10 points stacked on. But yeah, the scoring is really weird. Like, the way that they tack them up, you know, based on how many shots, and it's like, you know, you get a point for every shot you take. I don't know. It just kind of gives you the feeling of a nor of an average game where you'd have to get as many points as you can, but you're going for as few points as you can. So it's like, why is it not just going like one under par or one above? And why did that just skip out of the hole? Piece of piece of trash. Get back in there. Yeah, I mean, like, why didn't they just go with the uh, the normal one under minus one plus one, all that kind of stuff, like? Why this? This is just a confusing point system. Well, not confusing, and oh yeah, there's also... These are all par 3s, so... There's no par 4s, which I'm kind of surprised at. I don't know if it's normally have a par 4 in mini golf, but... The mini golf course I've played on... Had at least a couple of, uh... Of, uh, par 4s. It was, uh... I don't know. It's kind of weird seeing everything being par 3, and that was not enough power. God dang it. I hate how they aim you just so that you... I just hate how they aim you, like, straight off the edge. It's like, who's going to shoot there? Like, what the hell? But yeah, I mean, I don't know. Just the fact that these are all par 3s is kind of lame. Like, not that it's necessarily a huge problem, but... It'd be nice if there were at least some par fours. Like the golf, the mini golf course I played on at least had some longer courses, some longer par fours. 
and it's just kind of weird playing a virtual version. It's like, oh, they're just all par three, and that's it. I don't know. This is still a fun mode, but, I mean, it's just weird, you know? I think it's a cup and five. That's a double bogey, so I guess they don't... I guess they don't specify bogeys? I think if you just get a plain old bogey, it'll say that you got a bogey, but... Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe this is a little weirder than I thought. Get up there, quick! Oh, you fucking gotta be kidding me. Dude, oh my god. Okay, some of these are really weird. Some of these courses, man. Come on, that has to make it up. That didn't make it up. You literally have to be shitting me. Are you... What? Okay, apparently I have to go up to a 40. 40 yard shot. Let's go 30. There we go. No. No, it's just gonna fall back down. Really? Wow. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, I kind of wish I was playing Mario Golf Total Tour. I have my GameCube booted up so I can turn this off anytime I want, but... Damn, yeah. This is making me want to play something else, alright. There we go. Okay, I guess it, I guess my timing was a little off. I shouldn't have gone when it was straight up, but... I mean, that's still kind of dumb, you know? It's just... It's also kind of dumb how it still aims you straight off the edge. I don't like that. I hate that. And now it's still at a 40 with less distance, so that makes no sense at all. You just get further up, bounce off, and this should be my winning shot right here. This is it. So, gonna wait a second. Oh god, okay. <laughs> I thought I saw I saw the tip of the uh, the platform kind of show that. Oh, wow! I didn't realize I took that many shots. But yeah, I saw the tip of the platform kind of show, and I thought it was starting to give back and go down. Apparently, it was still going up. So my eyes deceived me. The game deceived me. I don't even know which one. Get that! Oh my god! <laughs> no. Nope, of course not. Oh man, some of these are so weird. No, go for this. Go for it! God dang, dude, why? Oh, this is hard. Man, these took a quick uh, peak in difficulty. Good, good, good lord. Look at that. I'm either flying off the end or I'm not getting anywhere close to it. Good lord. Like right there, go extra hard. I almost skipped up over that. I could have fallen off there. Good lord, this is hard. I can see why that other dude got a freaking 50 or whatever on the first course. Good gosh, I might actually get that here. I'd like to, uh, I don't know if I can view the scorecard. You hold, yeah, I can't really view the scorecard, but I have a feeling it probably isn't that good. Let's, uh, try going up here. There we, oh. Yeah, that looked really weird from the map, like, okay. You, you need to remember to, like, look around. I never really think to do that. Let's, okay, let's go, like, 30 or oh, 20, I guess. <laughs> Like that, and oh, look at that, that was perfect. I managed to pull a par out of that. <laughs> I went out of bounds and still managed to pull a par. Not very often you see that. Anyway, 41. It'd be nice if I could see the scorecard, like the final scoreboard. You can do that in Mario Golf, just to determine whether or not you're doing well, but here you can't exactly do that, so. I guess I'm gonna kinda guess. Really? Really? <laughs> Are we really doing this now? <laughs> Darn it. Okay. Well, let's go like two thirds of that. Like that. And no! What? Dang it, I thought I'd be safe. Okay, yeah. This is. <laughs> yeah. 
I mean, in real life, you wouldn't play an actual mini golf course like this, but good lord. That is still ridiculous. <laughs> and obviously, they're not trying to be realistic, but... I don't know. My head always tries to convince me they are, and so I just... Make bad choices. Eh. Man. I should still be able to get... Is that? Yeah, it's all connected. It kind of looks like there's a drop-off there, but there, there isn't one. Which is really, really weird that it looks like that. Oh my god, a cup and seven? Oh no, is it even going to be possible to... Oh, 48. I don't know if it's... I don't know if the leaderboard requirement is 50 or not this time, but... Uh, we might be screwed here. Hole nine. Okay, this one looks... Wow, what the hell? Well, there's no way I'm getting that in one one go. Uh, crap. Okay, I actually have to do something real quick. I'll be right back. All right, we're here. Hole number nine. I actually had to go and do something. And uh, there's no save function in Monkey Golf for some reason. So, yeah, we're resetting. And, uh... Oh man, this is something else. This is, well, this is the final hole. That is, I don't know if you're supposed to go over in one hit or not, but it doesn't look like there's much of a way to do that. So I think I'm gonna take the safe route here and we're just gonna kinda go up here a little bit and then we're gonna play it dirty. We're gonna, <laughs> gonna play with the physics a little bit here. Uh, yeah, I think we're gonna need, let's go 30 yards on that gauge. Oh, wow. All right, well, we don't wanna angle it too much. We definitely want it to land. Uh, yeah, land it to the left of the hole. So, aim it straight and do the same thing. All right, that's much more playable. <laughs> that is much better. And it didn't fly off. All right, we're still getting a five, but it should still work. Oh wow, I didn't read my club there, or read my uh, ball. It was only on 10 yards, not 20. Whoops, that was almost bad. But there we go. That is, that's it for Monkey Golf, unless there's more courses you unlock, which I don't think is the case. All right, first place. I don't think there were any spots on here with the old owner's name, so I think I'm actually the first person to, to score here. But uh, we did get first place, which is pretty cool. 45 hits, 45 shots. Yeah, see, look at that. There's nothing there. Let's still check back here. You still got uh, Dad over here with his uh, second place, 49. Um, pretty cool. And then there's Monkey Bowling. Uh, Master Mode, there's only one score on there. Uh, Expert Mode, yeah. So all the... Uh, <clears throat> All of those, I think everybody here is an actual human player that you're seeing on the scoreboard, but yeah, uh, I didn't exactly get any high scores here. Well, I did on beginner, but yeah, I got to extra course number three. So we're going to be checking out the expert courses in the next video, so that should be pretty cool. I don't know if there's any expert or extra courses in like uh, advanced or expert mode. I know that there are for sure uh, extra stages on beginner mode though. I'm not sure about advanced and I'm not sure about expert. I'm sure as hell not gonna even attempt master, but we will do the beginner um, extra stages. I don't know how many extra stages there are. Uh, the only extra stages I ever played were ones you saw on that uh, first episode we did so yeah that's as far as I've gotten and uh, next time I guess I'm gonna be going into some new territory I might have to go into the expert or the advanced mode for some extra uh, some extra bonus courses but um, I'm not sure maybe it's just gonna be 10 extra courses 20 extra courses here and 30 here I kind of doubt that 
I'm thinking it's just going to be a set number for each of these and it's going to be the same in each difficulty but we will find that out uh, in the next video uh, next time on Let's Play Super Monkey Ball Jr. when we check out the expert courses on the main game but until then I hope you all enjoyed thank you for watching and I'll see you all next time